Welcome back. In the previous tutorial, we studied about the basics of paragraph writing. We understood how to change the font size, the font style of the paragraph by going into the type menu. We also studied the various other functions that can be performed on the paragraphs. Here, in this tutorial, we will be studying in detail how to indent and tab a paragraph. Here, for reference purposes, we have already written a paragraph by clicking on the file and the new menu to save our time. We can select the type button and the indents and tabs menu. Our menu bar will open as shown. If one wants to change the alignment and do the indenting of a particular paragraph, it has to be chosen first. Hence, we will cancel this and choose the paragraph we want to edit. We will again go on the type button, select indents and tabs. We can also go to the menu bar by using Ctrl plus I together on the keyboard. As shown, a menu bar is seen. For our convenience, we make the zero coincide with the paragraph. To change the spacing, we can either write the position, for example, 0 0.56 inches, or by dragging the mouse button and changing as shown. We can change both the arrows by clicking on the downward arrow and dragging it where we want. If we click on the apply button, it will show us how our paragraph will look. Until and unless we click on the OK button, the changes won't be made in the original paragraph. On clicking on the OK button, we will see the changes appear. We will go back again to see the other functions of the indent tab menu bar. We can also choose the leader by clicking on the leader option. There are various options such as dots, small hyphens and a line. We right now select the none option. We can also change the end indentation by moving and dragging the arrow as shown. Clicking on the apply button will show us how our paragraph will look. Corresponding inches value is shown in this dialog box. We can also change the arrow buttons according to the, the way we want our paragraph to be. If we want our paragraph to be left aligned, we have to keep this selected. If you want the paragraph to look like this, we want we have to select this and accordingly all the four options. Clicking on the reset button will reset all the values. Clicking on the OK button will actually apply the changed and the indented things on the original paragraph or the apply menu is just for demonstration sake without actually changing the original paragraph the cancel button or this cancel button will undo all the changes one has made the original paragraph will remain as it is. This is in detail the indents and the tab function of the paragraph formatting section. Now on we will study another function of paragraph formatting. Thank you.
you.